What is going on guys, Apple Fox here, and a lot of people have installed the iOS 10 on their devices. It's okay, the iOS 10 is the latest update, 10.0.2 to be exact, but in general it brings many new things and features to the iPhone, including pressing a home button to unlock, instead of sliding to unlock. And this feature is something that not everyone actually likes or is used to. The slide to unlock is considered as the essential of iPhone, but now it is gone. But you already know all of this and the purpose of this video is to show you how you can get rid of clicking the home button when unlocking your iPhone. Why would you want to do that? Well, one of the reasons is that you don't like it, and also you don't realize it, but the home button is used a lot more in iOS 10 because of the new way of unlocking. And that could cause the home button to stop working. Unfortunately, there is no way to bring back the slide to unlock, of course we're not talking about jailbreak. The first thing you need to do is to set up a Touch ID. You also need to set up the password or passcode in order to use the Touch ID to unlock an iPhone. But this is not everything because even though you have the Touch ID set up, you need to press the home button to get inside your phone regardless. The only difference is that when you click on the home button with the Touch ID set up, you need to use the correct finger, otherwise you won't get in. As you can see I have to click it, it reads my finger while I'm pressing and that way it lets me in. So the home button still needs to be pressed, there is one thing you need to do. In the settings, under general and accessibility, you need to head over to the home button. There is a new toggle called rest finger to open. It is new but only when talking about the iOS 10, because it wasn't there in iOS 9. You have to turn it on, but what does it actually mean? Well, it is a way to unlock your iPhone just by placing your finger on the home button without the need to click it. So that's the reason why the first step was to set up a touch ID. So as you can see, you can just place your finger on the home button and you get inside. So this is how you can do it. It works even better if you use the raise to wake feature and you also don't need to press the power button to light up the screen. There is another way to unlock your iPhone without pressing the home button at all. This doesn't require any password or touch ID setup. So in the settings you have to turn on assistive touch, you probably know what it is. And one of the toggles is representing the home button. So on your lock screen you need to click on the assistive touch and then click the virtual home button and it gets you to the page where you can type in your passcode and get inside without ever clicking the home button. But this method is often used when the home button breaks and also it doesn't really look that nice when you always have it on your screen. So we're getting to the end of this video, it's also possible that you already knew this method but there are still people who didn't know it. Anyways, if you like this video then leave a thumbs up to let me know. Also make sure you watch my other videos and subscribe in order not to miss anything important because I'll be making more videos in the future. Have a great day, keep smiling and see you next time.